Hello and welcome to this episode of Microchips and in this episode we are looking at the new and exciting boards we have for 2023. We have some new VCOs and we have some new PLL replacement boards. So let's get started. So this year has been an absolute success for my VCO boards. We've made two VCO boards this year, a through hole version and a surface mount version. And yes, they've been a big seller. People seem to be very impressed with these. And I can't thank whoever's bought these. Can't thank you enough for supporting me in this. But we don't stop there. And new for 2023, we have these two new VCOs available. So this one has got the integrated voltage feed modification, which stabilizes the voltage supply to the VCO. And basically we've fitted an onboard five volt regulator to this VCO. And this VCO then needs to be connected to your AVR or 9 volts inside your radio. And this has got all the components necessary on board for a nice stable VCO voltage. And I was asked if I could make this. So yes, we've managed to do it. This VCO has got the components for the FM audio modification, which is needed on the Multimode 2s and variants using the 059 chassis. This VCO has got the parts that you would normally fit on the underside of the board, actually on the VCO module itself. And also it has the voltage feed modification as well. So basically it's an all-in-one modification for your radio for a nice stable VCO voltage and the FM audio uh, modification as well. The FM audio modification does require the other parts to the modification which requires removing a cap a coil changing a capacitor but then the rest of the parts are actually on this board and it works quite well so let's get on to the PLL modifications so this is an all-in-one replacement for your PLL O2A basically you take your PLL O2A out and you replace it with this board and as it is it will just work as a normal PLL but you have options for UK 1 to 40 readout from your high band crystal and minus 40 from your lowest crystal. All in one nice little board that just sits behind your channel change. Now this is a variant of the last one we just saw. Again it uses the MC145 106P PLL chip. So it is a complete replacement for your PLL 02A. And this will give UK 40 readout from high band. And it will also give alphas, so plus 10 kc where necessary, and also minus 5 kc switching as well to drop you onto zeros. All in one nice little neat package that is a complete replacement for your PLL O2A. So the next one we have is based on the 145157P2 PLL chip, and this gives slightly more than the last board. So basically, we've got UK40 from your high band crystal minus 40 from your lowest crystal we've got alpha channels where needed and we've also got 5kc switching as well which will drop you onto zeros when activated only one nice little neat package and the next one we have is for the experienced modder who wants to add a lot more channels to their radio so basically you would lock your radio to mid band so you'd hardwire it to mid band and then you'd use this board to control the rest. And this will give you five bands. So UK 40, 1 to 40 readout. You get high band, mid band, low band, and super low band. And of course, the alpha channels, the plus 10 KC where needed. And the last board we have here, the big daddy of the boards. This gives you five bands, alpha channels, and five KC switching. Again, this requires you to lock the radio to mid-band, so you'd hardwire your radio to mid-band, and then let this board do the rest. So we have UK40 readout, 1 to 40 readout, high band, mid-band, low band, and super low band. And lastly, for our Uniden radios, for the Superstar 3900, we have this six-band version which will give you five normal bands and the UK 1 to 40 readout and plus 10 KC as well. This board requires you to lock it to the lowest band on your radio and then this board then 
will take over and do the rest. So there we have it, the boards coming in 2023. I think we've managed to cover all variants with this and um, all the way from basic modifications all the way up to experienced modifications for the experienced modder. No matter what you want from your radio, I'm sure we've got a board that will cover it. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.